News, Kansas News Leader. An annual St. Patrick's Day party serves up an important purpose along with the food, drinks and fun. Neil Pipkin and Dave Thomas with the Topeka Gunslingers Motorcycle Club are here to explain. Welcome to both of you. Thank you for and having me. And we like when fun also helps other people, right? right. That's right. a good reason to have some fun. So Neil, what do you guys do every year for St. Patrick's Day? We hold a fundraiser to help local law enforcement and their families out in time of need. And it really is a party? It is it a is. party. What do you all do? <laughs> food. Food's good. Food, food, uh, music, yep. um, live auctions, silent auctions. We have door prizes. We hold two big raffle, two big item raffles at the end of the night. Um, and then party doesn't stop until everyone goes home. It doesn't stop until they, until they go home. It might right. be three days later. We don't know, but some people have to get to work. So maybe not. haven't had that one yet. <laughs> <laughs> you have a special guest this year, Dave. What's happening to kick everything off? Well, to kick everything off, we have Casey Wolf in town. It's going to show up. Uh, he'll be there from four to six. So everybody needs to come out, see Casey Wolf, enjoy, get some photos, um, have some food afterwards. And you Stick have around. a nice approach to this because you have a set fee for the raffle tickets, but everything else, there's no like set admission that you make people pay. No, everything is just it's a free will, will donation. Yeah, free will donation. Obviously, you hope people dig deep for that donation. Where right. does the money go? So we have roughly donated more than $30,000 since we started this over the last couple of years. We have uh, a group of individuals that choose where the money goes when something arises. If um, an officer gets hurt on duty, um, he or she needs help um, with any type of bills, with any sweat equity, um, with getting driven to and from doctor's offices, uh, even all the way down to mowing yards. Um, that's where that's where we come in and help out with that side. Support of their families, also their kids, wives, husbands, whatever they need. Well, you were you in law enforcement as well? Yes, ma'am. So you both were in law enforcement. Yes. Over the years, how have the two of you seen a need for a fund like this? It it's really increased. Um, you know, there's a lot of stuff that families need behind the scenes that maybe the agencies don't cover and uh, it really helps out a lot for them. Same Agreed, way. yeah, it's, it's just a growing number of, of interest and needs. How important is that law enforcement family? It's huge, Yeah. huge, yeah, you yeah. don't ever leave it. Once you're in, you don't ever leave it. Even if you hop on a motorcycle and exactly. ride around for fun, right? Right, right. <laughs> yeah. So what are some of the things that are in the auctions this year and what are your big raffle items, can you say? Um, well, I think we can. Yeah. <laughs> um, yes, so we have uh, two firearms at the end of the night. Um, and then during, all throughout, during the event, we have um, raffles as far as um, gift cards to local, local shops. We have at least five baskets that's a silent auction. And one will be hopefully full of Kansas City um, wines, championship wines and things like that. Um, car dealing, car detailing basket. I know we, we like a clean motorcycles, just like <laughs> right. we do a clean cars, but um, throughout the night, it will be gift cards to restaurants, gift cards to Harley Davidson here mm -hmm. locally. Um, we do have t-shirts that we give out. Um, What's on the food menu? This year it's hamburgers and hot dogs. Right. Love it. Um, and there is uh, adult beverages as well as uh, beverages for kids um, and it is all again it's a free will donation and you really hope this is a family oriented event bring everybody out to see Casey Wolf. Absolutely. It, it always yep. is family oriented yep. every year um, it's family yep every year it's family oriented um, when the weather is good we have bounce houses for the kids but this year it's Casey Wolf Casey Wolf is cool too, and have fun. Join the family because we're all part of their family. Saturday, March 16th is when this takes place. Again, Casey Wolf photos from four to six. Food service begins at six, and then all the other stuff unfolds after. This is at the Topeka FOP Lodge. It's 2649 Southeast 45th Street. So if you're heading east on 45th, if you get to Shawnee Heights Road, you've gone too far. Right. That's there'll, always... be, there'll be flags and stuff to okay, good. <laughs> show, the, show the direction. Join in the fun. Guys, thank you so very much. Appreciate you thank being you. here. Thanks for having us. A few clouds rolled in with that shift in the wind. Find out what it means for the number of layers you'll need next in Daniel McDonald's First Alert Forecast.